Hey, this is Jeff at Miller's RV, and I'm here today with an amazing coach. This is Tiffin's flagship, the Zephyr. It's a 45 foot, 500 horsepower, beautiful motorhome. We're gonna get inside, show you all the features inside, the gorgeous cabinets, the glazed cabinets where they have, um, amazing look, but just so many features. We're gonna start with a quick walk on the outside to show you some of the extras that come standard on this coach. Tip and Zephyr is one of the best values out there when you compare it with the same engine and stuff you're gonna get in an uh, Essex or King Air on the higher end coach in that year, but they have a lot less price. It's one kind of Tiffin's mantra. They offer a lot of bang for the buck, and this coach is in excellent shape with low mileage. I think you're really gonna like it. Let's take a quick look. So just quickly on the outside of the coach, you won't be able to see it. We'll show you a quick cutout of it in a second. But the awning, this does have the two Carefree Paramount awnings. Uh, the roof rails, the way it makes the coach look, it really hides the air conditioners and stuff like that. Really gives it a high-end look on the coach. One of the first years they came out with that on the Zephyr. Uh, but you'll love the full-length awning. It gives you tons of tailgating space, lots of room. Of course, keyless entry is just part of the coach. Uh, it has a cut and buff paint system, which is the one that feels real smooth. You can't feel the lines in it, really nice. They even paint the frames and carry the paint job into the window frames with the flush mount windows. So just really extremely clean look, very beautiful coach. Uh, made in house with Tiffin. Uh, they're thicker fiberglass than most manufacturers use, so really high quality. I've been to the Tiffin plant. One thing I love about it, when they first come in, and one way they get this really smooth paint job, the motorhome is brought in and they paint the whole motorhome blue, like a big Smurf and then they sand it. And the reason they do that is when they're sanding it, as they sand the coach down, any low spots that are in the sidewall stand out blue. So the first sand job to get it really smooth also shows if there's any imperfections in the fiberglass and allows them then to fill that in, smooth it out, and give you this really, really clean uh, finish that you don't get with most manufacturers because they don't take that extra step of that first sand job. So really, really neat plant. And then of course their paint job, they have a bake, uh, multiple ba paint bake booths. So the paint gets in there, sprayed on, baked, really has high lasting, high quality, uh, beautiful shine of paint. Of course you have your exterior tray pulling out with your refrigerator built in here, 12 volt or 110, it can be a refrigerator or a freezer. Great for tailgating again, because you can set the temperature exactly what you want, you'll love it. Another thing that I always like to mention on this is their doors. Now everybody else's, you know everybody's got an aluminum frame or aluminum uh, basement compartment doors, but their doors are just a heavier duty door. They have a full piano hinge, but just listen to this. It sounds like you're shutting a car door. That's something you go shut a, an, elect, an American Eagle or something else and it, it just feels really lightweight and it doesn't hold up well. Well, imagine that. This tends to hold up better. Uh, tremendous support from the factory as well if something is going wrong, but you'll really find that we just don't have as many problems because of the extra quality they put into this unit to start with. So we'll continue to walk around. Another great thing they do, uh, they put on all the coach standard is a battery reminder for your chassis batteries. So when you're plugged in at a shore power, your house batteries are always going to be charged, but they just put standard where your, your chassis batteries are being charged too. So you don't have to worry about not using it for a couple of months and having chass bat chassis battery problems. I love the look in this coach. It's so beautiful. All of the hardwood cabinets, uh, of course, everything in this, not just the doors are, are hardwood, not just the fascias, even the, the cabinets themselves. But one thing that's really nice is all of this wood uh, is hand routed in Tiffin's uh, wood shop. Again, they're, if you haven't had a chance to visit the factory, you really should. It's really an amazing place. But even these um, insets and all of this little angled pieces and the coves and all that, these are done inside. I think these might actually be purchased. I can't remember if those are done inside or not. But all this stuff is done inside. The importance of that is down the road, if there's a problem, if you've damaged something, we can actually call up Tiffin and they can make us these parts. Um, a lot of manufacturers, they buy their woods and buy their cabinetry from somebody else. Um, so, you know, two, three years down the road, yeah, good luck finding anything because they've switched vendors, that vendor's out of business. Here, Tiffin makes these cabinets. They make all the trim pieces as well. And it all matches because it's all made out of the same hardwood and then stained to match. So beautiful, beautiful cabinetry. Same thing with their Corian. They do their Corian in-house too. Uh, so this is a stack Corian. So they stack the rail, they route everything in-house. Um, you know, means that your colors obviously will match on your countertops here and then it's all polished in-house. Um, and again, they even put a little lip on this so that you do have, if you have a spill, it's not just gonna run right off on the floor, which is important in a motorhome. The backsplash, all this is hand laid in their factory. So the, uh, you know, there's people in there laying out these uh, little leaf patterns and the, the white and the black and all this little intricate designs, all done in house. They're a tile floor. Again, this is porcelain floor done in house. 
Really cool way they do it. A lot of manufacturers still have cracking problems in their tile and in their grout. And you just don't see that in the Tiffin. Uh, it's unusual to see it. Of course, it, can, it could possibly happen, but it's not something you see regularly like you do in a lot of the manufacturers. And they use a design where the floor is actually laid on a plywood sheet uh, and all the tile is laid down. Uh, and it's glued with a non-hardening seal, just like they use in all, most of the RVs and the, tile, the grout they use is special. But then when they put it on the floor of the unit, there's a separate plywood floor also on the unit, laminated floor. And then when they attach the two, they use the same non-hardening seal. So it just gives a little bit of a buffer. So as the, tor as the chassis twists and torques, um, you don't crack your tile which is a real important thing because they, they do include extra tiles in the basement uh, when the coaches are brand new, but over time you can either use or lose those, but trying to find them after the fact is really difficult. Uh, so Tim and does that, just kind of take it away. Furniture is all Villa Furniture. All of your um, shades and blinds, both your day shades and your night shades in the living area are electric, so touch the button and you can drop everything down or raise them up. Um, electric cooktop, dishwasher of course. Uh, really nice serving area here as well that pulls out um, and gives you a place to have extra uh, drinks and chips and stuff like that out. But just love the functionality and the use of their coach. And again, it's just so beautiful. Their air conditioning is another big thing. A lot of manufacturers, um, you're, you have a return air and it's a little bit louder coach. When you notice the air running in the Tiffins, it's very, very quiet. And that's because they've raised the air, air conditioners up and they've sealed them in the roof. Uh, and then your duct work, the way it works here is everything on this side of the coach is return air. Everything on this side of the coach is exhaust. So by doing that, you end up getting a much quieter unit. So when the airs are running, you're not screaming over each other. Uh, and you really can't even tell where the airs are. So it's kind of quiet and much more even coach, uh, even cool throughout the entire coach. Um, of course, reading lights and sconces, all those are really beautiful. Um, that's about it in the living area. Full-size fridge is in the slides, so lots of room. Midship TV, and we'll get a shot in a second, but the two chairs in the front turn around, and the passenger side is a recliner, so it gives you a great area to watch the TV as well. Um, just a beautiful coach all the way around. We're gonna look in the bedroom uh, and show you the mid-bath and the lunch room, and then the bathroom in the back is really one of the masterpieces in this coach. So let's go take a look. So we're staying in the bedroom now, obviously in the midship of this coach, there's a stackable washer and dryer and a private water closet there, half bath there. Uh, it gives you a nice way just to close off this bedroom. So when you have guests, everybody has a bathroom, but your, your bedroom, your space is private. Um, of course, uh, another thing, king size bed, sleep number. This actually has the Ralph Lauren package, which is an upgrade package they offer that year. Um, really nice feature. Uh, I just like to, you know, this in most coaches is just a plain wall. Uh, and here, there's, this is nothing. This is just your wall separate in your bathroom, but they put the raised panels, they put the extra trim pieces in. Uh, all that's done just to add that extra case. And I, I didn't mention, but this is all glazed cabinets. So after the cabinets are stained, they wipe them with the glaze and it gives you that depth of the look, lets you see the grain better, the cuts in the, uh, in the raised panels better as well. And even this is done in-house. So this is a, a glass insert behind uh, hardwood panels that just give you a really, really pretty look. Now your bedroom back in here, this does go in and we'll look at it. Uh, really nice back uh, bedroom area on this. Dual sinks, kind of a contemporary look there. Huge closet, big storage area. Um, just a, again, all around great coach. Ceiling fan in here, electric flush toilets front and rear. Uh, a ton of features in this motorhome. I think you should come take a look and see, but we'll take the back bathroom out real quick first. So in addition to a really functional unit uh, back here, um, the column accents are just really beautiful and you can see all that again done in house if you ever need to get them or replace them But the backsplash is great. So this is all hand laid tile backsplash uh, This little cut tile in the center and then the diet the extra uh, Cutting accents down in the bottom corner part of that uh, But a very not only is it a functional shower, but it's beautiful And that's one of the things about the Zephyr they add that extra level of luxury to the already beautiful unit. Uh, even the floor access to the engine is recessed and nice and um, simple, doesn't have a big latch on it or something like a lot of them do. So just a great motorhome. There's a safe in the closet, uh, double mirrors on the closet door, just give you that, uh, your wife that full length mirror when she needs it. Um, skylight here, of course, power vents front uh, galley and in the midship bath as well. So really a great coach. The next thing you need to do though is come test drive this thing. With the 500 Cummins, larger tires and wheels, uh, wheels the same size, 22 and a half, which of course is all the Allegro bus products, but the Zephyr has the larger tires front and rear. So you get a better ride in this, uh, smoother, really, really powerful engine with that ISM 500 Cummins. Um, something I think you'll really, really like. So come take a look, test drive, but really, really, I think this is a coach you might like. Again, this is Jeff Hilliard at Miller's RV reminding you, enjoy the journey. Thank you.
Hey, this is Jeff at Mills RV. Thank you so much for watching this video. We really appreciate it. Check out one of the other videos linked here or su subscribe to our YouTube channel. You'll get all the video updates when we come out with them. Catch our content on Facebook as well or visit our website, millersrv.com. Again, Jeff at Millers RV reminding you always enjoy the journey.